was from the streets of Philadelphia, and he, he was a boxer when he was young, and he had a boxer's mentality. He just hits those guys with those fists, and they go sideways all the time. He had a club move. He had a headbutt move. Just flat out mean. He wasn't interested in just winning on the play and blocking his guy. He absolutely wanted to demoralize him. Now somebody calm him down. And I never saw anybody take Reggie White and throw him five yards back and put him on his back. It was the first of Central State University's three national titles during the decade. He was a dominant force on the offensive line and it was named to the All-American team. Big E was then selected by the Dallas Cowboys in the third round of the 1991 NFL Draft. In 1992, he earned national attention for holding Reggie White without a sack in a 20-10 Dallas win, earning the NFC's Offensive Player of the Week award. Williams is still the only lineman in Cowboys history to win that honor. His physical play and aggressive attitude made him arguably the top offensive lineman in the NFL. With the Cowboys, Williams was a three-time All-Pro and four-time Pro Bowler. His ability to protect quarterback Troy Aikman and to run block for running back Emmitt Smith helped the Cowboys win three Super Bowls. He was part of one of the best offensive lines in NFL history, which was dubbed the Great Wall of Dallas. Many believe that if not for the injury suffered in his near-fatal car accident, he would have finished his career as the greatest offensive lineman in NFL history. Williams dominated on the offensive line of scrimmage for the Cowboys from 1991 to 2000 and started 133 games. Williams is listed number 28 on the 50 greatest Cowboys list.